Hi, I'm Tiffany Jasmine Wiley. I hate my fucking first name. You know why? Because it's for a girl. I am no girl. I was raised to be a fucking girl. Fucking woman. Well, a fucking girl anyway. Not a woman. Anyway, <clears throat> what I have to say is going to be permanent. Mary Kelly and Robert Kelly. If they ever want me to like them and not beat them fucking up, they're going to have to make me happy. Robert's going to have to pay for my GED, pay for my tutor, pay for my fucking driver's license, and help and make, make them sure that I get an adult job or he helps me get my fucking books off the ground. Our fucking business off the ground. Something that an adult has by now. That's his responsibility to me as his ex wife. But he doesn't give a shit. You know why? I'm not white, rich, I am LGBT, and I have a little bit of mental, dis mental touch of mental retardation. That's Robert. Treat him like a child for the entire marriage. Children go on errands for their fam for their parents, right? That's all I did. I didn't fucking do anything that a wife does. Nothing but have sex with him. So basically, since I was a child, which means I might make him a pedophile. To prove it that he's not a pedophile towards me. He's gonna have to pay for my my GED. Since I sacrificed my education for him. He's gonna have to pay for my tutor. Since huh, guess what? He doesn't want me to learn. Doesn't want me to just be smart or or an adult. So I'm gonna fucking beat the crap out of him. Or frame him. Well, not frame him. That's stupid. What I'm going to do is going to beat the crap out of him and make them sure he pays. And make sure that his groin gets the worst of it. I'm going to take away his man card so he took away my man card. Mary is an evil little cunt with her fucking evil little cunt family. If Mary was a Christian fucking woman, like she's supposed to be, she would have been behind Robert's back from day one. Send me a fucking friend request. And actually talk to me like a fucking friend. Now shouldn't she? Did she? No, she didn't. And if she didn't do that, and she didn't make, make sure that Jasmine Freshness had a way to contact me for emergencies because, hello, guess what? I'm genetically related to Jasmine and Precious. So if they needed a fucking kidney or something like that, I would be the best bet. But guess what? How are they going to get a hold of me, right? Robert? Fuck you, Robert. Fuck you, Mary. And fuck you, your fucking twin sister. For that reason, Mary's never going to be a Christian lady. She's going to be an evil little cunt. Who I like to destroy. And make sure she's ugly. Poor. And mentally challenged. So Robert would disrespect her. Every fucking day afterwards. Because that's what he would do. That's what he did to me. Every fucking day of our marriage. By not letting me be adult. Disrespecting me. Guess what? He kissed my ass. And suck my cock. And I hope he chokes on it. Because you know why? Because I mean it. Robert's dead to me. Mary's dead. Mary's twin sister is dead too. Until I get what I want from them. I'm never going to love them. I'm going to hate the fucking... I, I hate them fucking thing. Why? Because they might buy my hind by back. 
Cause, huh? Robin knew when I got I got injured by my man, but I was twelve. Fuck that, right? That's what a teenage boy says. A teenage boy is supposed to pressure their teenage girlfriend for sex. Did he? No, he did not. You know why? Because Mary was fucking him the whole time. Either the whole time or he's fucking some other loser. I wasn't. I was jerking off in the shower. In a fucking cold shower while I was a teenager. But guess what? When I was supposed to go in the battle of the bands, did he pick me? No, buddy, but, but I bet you anything, Mary was there. Big fatty with the fucking glasses. And guess what? That's also the reason why I start. That's the reason why I started pulling me away from him. Not to love him. Or to be. Or to start getting depressed. And when he didn't fucking tell me he was a wicked. Black witch. Warlock. That's also the reason why he pulled away from me. He pulled away from me. I didn't pull away from him. I sacrificed my education for him. Because he made me feel like I was guilt. I was neglecting him. And guess what? I'm on welfare. Yeah, he loves that. He loves me being on welfare. He loves me being on SSI. Even though that makes me feel like a retard. But he doesn't care. He wants my little girl to be on, on welfare. Jasmine, Autumn, Gail, Kelly. He also wants precious Summer Rain Kelly on welfare. That's why I don't want them smart and beautiful. Even though I know they are. Jasmine is going to be a fucking child psychologist for the Fort Worth Public Police Department. Ja precious... It's going to be a sketch artist for the Fort Worth Police Department. You know why? Because that's where they're supposed to be. Jasmine was supposed to be going to college. She knew it. She knew she was good at doing that stuff. Helping people. Making people feel, people feel happy. Guess what? Robert destroyed it. So now, now Billy's going. No, no. Robert is never going to allow Jasmine to help anyone or make anyone happy. Yeah, because Robert doesn't want that for her. Robert doesn't want her having any fucking good thing happen to her. And that's the reason why I made that promise to her. Never get married until you fucking have a, a house of your own. I did it for a safety measure and guess what? Robert is going to make damn sure she gets pregnant, knocked up. You know why? So she can get on welfare and so she get married. Breaking my promise, breaking her promise to me, and so I can hate her. Fuck you, Robert. If I find out my kids are on welfare, you're gonna get what's coming to you. I'm gonna make damn sure of it. Jasmine, if Jasmine Precious ever gets on welfare. After they're 18, you guys are going to get the fuck out of it. And I'm going to make, make sure. Because once I finally see you and recognize you, you're going to get the beating like your lifetime. And I might have something sharp in my fucking hands. My kids better not be on welfare. And my grandkids better not be on welfare. Did I make my fucking self clear? So you better make sure my child... My child, not yours, because I raised her myself as a single mother. You didn't. You weren't there for colics. You weren't there all the night, up all night. You weren't there for what? Science day of her fucking school? You didn't make sure she had friends. You didn't make sure she stayed out of her fucking shell. And you didn't make sure she wasn't, what, healthy? I did. I didn't want her having any health problems. I didn't want her having diabetes that runs in my family. You knew it. 
Why else do you think I didn't get her soda? I didn't get her soda twice a, twice a week. The rest of the time was tea, water, and Kool-Aid. And the, the tea was watered down a little bit. The, wa the Kool-Aid was a little watered down. Mostly was juice or milk also. that was, Milk wasn't watered down and juice wasn't watered down. I made sure she was healthy. And she was. She was losing weight that you want that she gained because of those other idiots that had her. So, yeah. That is what Jasmine's supposed to be. She's supposed to help children. Because she's a good mother. And I know that. But you destroy that probably. And she was going to be a good wife. But you destroy that too. Now she doesn't want to be either. Probably. But she has to be that. Because that's what she's supposed to be. She's supposed to be a child psychologist for the Fort Worth Police Department. Because you were supposed to be a cop, remember? With my help, you would have been. You fucking listen, you retard. But not, you're not a cop, right? You blame me, right? You blame me for your music career. Blame me for everything else, right? Guess what? I'm going to be a tell-off for you. I want to make damn sure you and Mary go down in history for destroying a mentally challenged queer man and coming after them with a hate crime. And causing them to be poor, homeless, and unable to get a good job. So I'll be on welfare for the rest of my life. Thank you, Robert, for causing me welfare. And do you think having Billy... Donald Roberts is going to keep me off of welfare? you got to be fucking kidding me, you retard. That's still welfare and it's still homeless. That's how I make my money? Myself? I'm just keep saying, keep saying I'm, I'm homeless and I'm broke and I'm poor. Because that's what you wanted me to be. Right? But guess what? This is your YouTube video for you. And I'm going to beat the crap out of Mary, her twin sister, and any, any of Mary's family. For, just, for not giving me what I want. What I want. What I want from you, Robert. And I better fucking get it. If you don't want me coming after Mary's family. With my fists. Or anything sharp in my hands. Or your fists. Or you. I won't come after Jasmine or Precious. They're my angels. Your other fucking kids aren't. They're your demon seeds. And I'm not going to think about that. I'm not going to give a shit about them. I don't. But guess what? I hate now. Because of that reason. So. Robert, you better fucking give me my fucking GED. Out of your own damn pocket. A uh, way to get to what your own dad pocket. A tutor to make down sure I graduate and I get my fucking my fucking GED. So I can get a good job. So I'm gonna have another kid. And guess what? You're not allowed to fucking have it. And I'm not going to stop either. I'm gonna make everyone fucking do the mud. So I know that you have it. Your friend, it was your friend is Billy, right? From this is our telegram, where you and him worked, right? And guess what? You're going to cause Billy Donald Roberts, his familyhood, and I'm gonna come after him as well, and his family. For fucking pain, him to get me out of my fucking apartment. That was my home. This is not my home. I don't have one. Race hard. And guess what? I'm never gonna love you. I'm never gonna love Mary. I'm not gonna like her as a best friend. 
or a good Christian person. Mary's never a Christian. She was. She should have fucking went behind my, behind your damn back, and made damn sure that I have contact with her, or at least be my friend. Did she? No. Do you know why? Cause she, you and her set this up a long ass time ago. I just finally got the hint, didn't I? And now I'm gonna make sure everyone fucking knows it. That you cheated me out of my fucking life. My livelihood. And me being an adult in your relationship. You didn't want me to be an adult, that means you're a pedophile. You want me not to call you a pedophile? Then I gotta have my GED. I gotta have a fucking good paying job that's an adult paying job or a fucking business that's mine. That I get all the money from it. Or, and I better have a fucking license. You better make that sure. I get one as an adult and a car that you have to pay for. Or I'm gonna keep calling you a pedophile who wanted to sow his wool oats with a child. Me. Because I didn't get to do adult things in our fucking relationship. I didn't have the adult things. That's why I made me a child, right? Guess what? You're going to be a pedophile from now on. That's how I get my GED. My driver's license. My car. My business. Or a good paying job that's an adult job. Not a fast food. Not a grocery store. Understand? I'm also going to think about that, Mary. Mary planned that as well. I'm going to hate Mary's family. And I'm going to hate your family as well. But Jasmine Fresh is the only one I love and care for. And I only care for Izzy as well. Those are the three people I love and I care for. And I'm never going to change my mind. And you better know this. I pinky promise myself. If your fucking friend doesn't come through and be my fucking real boyfriend, she paid him off for giving me an apartment, for giving me away from my job, so me homeless and broke and on the streets. I pinky promise myself. I will give him back with payment, and you. And Mary would be on the same boat. And somebody named Gloria would be on the same boat. If I don't get what I want. Billy. Gotta give me my memories. Happy ones. And I better have fun. Before I get a job. And I better fucking go on fucking a lot of fucking dates. That are expensive as fucking hell. From him. You better treat me special. So I'm never going to be the trophy wife of no one that's connected to him. Understand me? And that's per minute. So if I don't get what I want, Mary, you're going to be married to a pedophile. And Mary, you're going to be a loser, non Christian hater of the LGBT. Mexicans and also people who are mentally challenged. Understand me? And Robert, if I find Precious, find out that she was on Rillin or anything else like that for any length of time, you better make it up to her by getting her a fucking tutor and make damn sure she's smart. Understand me? Better make sure my children are smart. Better make sure my children graduate. Make sure my children go to college. Make sure my children don't ever go on SSI or welfare. Because once they do, your ass is grass with Mary's family. Understand me? Pinky promised myself this. I don't like bringing Pinky promise and I don't, never will. I would never bring a promise. 
once it's made, it's permanent. And since you made me break a few of them, your ass is already grass in my book. So this is your warning. And see you in hell. Because that's where you belong, Robert Thomas Kelly. Billy Donald Roberts. Also, Mary and your twin sister. For not giving me what I want. For not letting me be the adult in the relationship. And not do not being, being making my damn sure my fucking child would not go on welfare when she gets adult. And go to college. So if my daughter doesn't go to college, your ass is grass. If my daughter doesn't get a good career, your ass is grass. My grandkids better not fucking be homeless. So I was thinking about them, you retard. If she's on, if she gets a fucking man from you, she will be on home. She will be kicked out when she's pregnant, and she will have her kids be on welfare and get homeless, where her kids be kidnapped as well from her fucking what her boyfriend. So my my grandkids better not fuck me on welfare. My kids better not be on welfare. My kids better fucking go to college and graduate from high school. And they better be getting a fucking good career. So they won't never be on welfare. And they will never be homeless. Because my grandkids deserve better than that. My kids deserve better. My grandkids deserve better. Understand me? Bye you fuckers.